Are we recording? Yes we are, hello there. Uh, today's bench is being sat on by Lee T and it belongs to Jan Fellows MBA. JP, she was a special lady. Well, how about that? Right, we are in, <coughs> excuse me, Mutchell Park or Manor Road, as a, we, uh, as a kid I would call it. We're gonna head that away. Just come from that, that away. Um, just doing a review. I've just had a look. I think it's 694 kilometers, which I have mathematically worked out to be 400 miles. I've done on the um, King Song S18. There we go, just a bit of a do-do round. Cover the old photo cell, see if you can have some light. There you go. This is my go-to wheel at the moment. So, let's leave Jan Fellows his bench. Put you on extended pole because there's somebody coming. That's what she said, I'm coming. And I'm gonna head out and do a bit of a route, but I have found something in Wolverhampton that I want to share with you. So I'll tuck my way through the human traffic. Voila. And be back in a moment. So, today's ride is, I see all these reviews on um, YouTube, you know, the, the 100 mile ride, the 215 kilometer ride, 1000 mile ride, ride review. Um, the S19 is coming out soon. Uh, so, I shall insert a picture here of the S19. It's very nice, it's like a cross between this, this one uh, the S18 and check we're all clear. Yep, and the S22. Um, looks a decent price as well. Hopefully, hopefully you can hear me okay as well. Uh, Going to head out Goldthorn Hill, Phoenix Park, and then um, just a little bit of a rip, local rip. Uh, Lee the Ripper. Talking of rippers, um, I did have that alarm that I used to sound on my. Um, like a bike alarm thing. No, it was rubbish. Didn't get well, it wasn't rubbish, it was good, but nobody pays any attention. They may pay more attention to the ding dong. So, I will come back very shortly. Just heading out over. Oh, Goldthorn on Himley Crescent. And they took out by a BMW. Right, back in a bit. Just right by the Royal um, Metro. I was going to ride up there, but I thought better not. Talking of uh, metros or trams, here comes one now. Uh, so I'm going to head down Horsley Fields and pick up the canal um, into, Wentz, into Bentley Bridge, and then you know, that's it. Yeah, yeah man. Um, yeah, and then show you this hidden thing I found. So. Oh, female driver, doing a grand job to Birmingham and back and they're just putting one in now to um, Murray Hill Centre. So, don't cross yet. So, we are on the Willinall Road at Horsley Fields and this is where the canal is still closed on, um, since that fire. So there, where is this? Go a bit, 
go out actually over the canal bridge be easier just drop off here there we go train going to uh, different places oh. there you go that's what's left of that fire that um, caused the canal to close right we're going that way so if I can get over this rose let's try more extendy there we go that's better squeeze through the gap so you can see just there it is oh is it open no way it's never open let's go and have a look do a little scoochy round uh, oh my god it's open again there's me saying it was closed hang on a sec I'm not as good as Ivan up these um, paths looks like it's back open then hang on make sure the handle's engaged don't have a mischief and fall off so is it back open oh my god it is yeah at last that's good well you can see uh, see a bit better from here oh there we go have a little sit down that is what I want to learn like I said this year is how to sit down on these things oh, okay so horsey fields is back open guys I'm going to put this vlog out in the last week of April which is this is the penultimate weekend um, 2023 so back in a mile I love this section down here of the canal going towards Bentley Bridge nice and flowy top quality as well um, tow paths none of your rubbish stuff like um, going past the end of here it just goes um, to horrible stuff but today was meant to be a washout hello Mr Goose hissy hissy um, today was meant to be a washout with the weather this weekend and woke up this morning and it was a bit misty and murky but the sun broke through so weather people book your ideas you say one thing and then it's not it doesn't even happen it's springtime got a spring into spring loads of geese about and suicidal ducks <laughs> a drake and a duck mallard isn't it my bad um yeah weather wise it's looking good there's always something going on in wolverhampton loads of tat and building works being done anyway coming to the end of it so i want to show you this other there's a um, little car park i want to have a little ride around as well so back in a while Just coming to the end of the canal bit, that's Bentley Bridge. I'm going to go left and over to a multi story I forgot to do last time I did my NCP EUC. So let's go and find it. So I've ridden that one, that's the one staff one, but there's that one over there. That we're going to go and ride around and that's taller so just weave me way through and we'll go and have a look here we are I think it's about five story so that's the way out oh, that's the way out so let's go for a ride up <laughs> typical I'm going the uh, opposite way that's it Rob we'll, we'll do the correct way so my thoughts on the King Song S18 I love it I think it's one of the best EUCs I've had King Song XL I have to duck my head down a bit because as you can see it's very high um, yeah the 18 XL was brilliant just a bit harsh on you but this is um, obviously he hasn't got the size battery that the 18XL has. Hopefully I'll get my X18s and my uh, 
whatchamacallit, the S18 is the right way around. I have now got a um, veteran Sherman. I have got a vlog coming up on that. Um, picked that up off Mr. Mr. Richard and it originally belonged to Andre, so brilliant um, bit of kit and I got it at a good price. And I think, Rich, you have bought the um, EX20. Let's give you a bit of a view. The EX20, the goad. And I think you're selling it, <laughs> as you do. Nice little views over. Wolverhampton Hospital. That's A&E. &E. Or ER, as they say in America. Yeah, my, I love this, um, love this EUC. And I got it last October 2022 and uh, it's brilliant, just love it. I think this is the highest point. Hey Mr. Camera, see the cameras? Watching me, watching you, uh, you've got some good views from up here I tell you. I'll tell you what, I'm going to give you a bit more of a better view, there you go. 360. So, back to the EUC. Like I say, I've upgraded the pedals. Love those. Suspension is dialed beautifully. I'm not sure about the um, street, I think they call them street tires. I do like it, it's controllable. Will you shut up, you stupid seagulls? They're not called seagulls, Lee, because they're not at the sea, they're called gulls, or land gulls. Anyway, um, yeah, um, I've got a knobby tire on my veteran Sherman um, and that's that's good so oh, let's descend um, been uh, stalked by the the gulls have a little look over this side that's where I've just come in from there's the other car park I rode up last time so let's do a descent and a pan around with some music I've been thinking about the good times I've been sleeping through the long night I've been shining in the sunlight I've been thinking how I'm alright There's a reason for my feelings There's a reason why I'm healing Yeah, I feel higher than the ceiling All because of you You and I were so sweet, so sweet Talk until we asleep, asleep Every night I fall deep, fall deep But love, yeah you really get me, get me Make me fall to my knees, my knees Every night I fall deep, fall deep alive Yeah, wait a minute, wait a minute Don't you leave me before I get to kiss ya Wait a minute, I don't wanna be without you Yeah, wait a minute, wait a minute I can let you go before I kiss ya so I just come off the Canuck Road and turned into Park Lane and I'm going down Challenge Way and this is what I wanted to show you. You alright? Hiya! Hiya! Hi, hi. <laughs> Bless him. So down this alley is something I found the other day and this is the only one I know of in Wolverhampton and it is Wait for us, I'll just uh, bring you in. Look at that. A railway crossing. And it leads to Fowler Park. And the only trouble is, here is the gates come towards you. It's great when you're going through. But yeah, look. Hang on, let's just straighten the camera. I'm really, really happy I found this. There you go, that way is Wolverhampton, that way is wherever the train goes. So are there any cameras watching here? There aren't, are there? Just my camera watching me. It's a quiet track. In all the years I've lived in Wolverhampton, I never knew this was here. But yeah. Might hang on for a train to come past. Um, I've put some... <laughs> WD-40 on my 
pedals recently because every time I mounted the and dismounted, all I got was ar -ee, ar -ee, like a creaking. So that was really doing my sweeting. So I might hang on here, see if I can see a train pass. That'd be cool. Yeah, let's wait. Nothing. Mm. I've waited 10 minutes. You can guarantee, as I go, you know it's going to come past. The ghost train. Oh, that, that's good. Right, let's have a little ride around Fowler Park. I wonder if this is where like all the dogs go for a dump. The dog Fowlers. Please notice, motorbikes can jump over cars. <laughs> There's a the canal just there. There's Wolverhampton incinerator. But all the all the trash goes to. So we're gonna now head down towards Aldersley. I might go round I-54. What time is this? Have I got time? Yes I have. Right, back in a bit. Just oh, going under the uh, viaduct. Right by um Wolverhampton Dunstall Hill race course. God damn it's windy today. It's like the weather could change just like that. Let's have a look at the sea geese. See if they hiss at me. Hang on. Turn you around. Come on, you're on YouTube. No. <laughs> If that train is going over that bloody track that I've just waited 10 minutes for, I will not be a happy person. Son of a... riding along the uh, canal now normally I go that way under the bridge and then pick up central swale but there's an alternative way I've found this way now but I have to get on to I think it's the Wobaston Road so let's just tackle this bit of uh, track and we'll go on our shortcut oi oi <laughs> What's that? He's lost a wheel. Right, I've got to try and remember the way. I'm sure this brings us out onto... Well, it brings us out onto a road anyway. And... I found a little cheeky shortcut. There you go. Up here. Do a right. And then I want to join Central Swale. And then... Cl Cleverly Coppice or something like that. And then round I-54 and then back. Oh, hell yes, we are at our place. Here we are. So that way I've just ridden down. Oh, let's just do this. Um, was called Pendiford Droveway. So this is just, the canal is just, hopefully there you can see. Um, and this little cheeky track. I like a cheeky trail or a cheeky track. This track is um, what rejoins it. Just nice. Come up by, um, I-54 by all the businesses. So you can see behind that way is where I would have uh, come from. And we're heading that way, Central Swale. There's another place of interest I wanted to show you. So back in Now considering it was fiddling down with rain yesterday, um, everywhere is nice and dry. Central Swale. Good bit of track around here. You can get a shot of me riding, like an aerial shot. Some of this stuff makes your tram line. Central squiggle. I've ridden this loads of times on the bike, but just love riding this on the EUC. A bit of freedom. You're right. Hi, mate. 
nice, nice round here. Give you a bit of a view. And it's all open to the public. Putting nature and business together. Up here is, um, I think it's all protected land, I'm pretty sure it is. So, back in a mo. Point of interest, that bench is where I first met Ivan, chasing pavement. I was coming past on my bike and uh, Mark, who I was riding with, he went, Lee, 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 is that one of them things you ride? <laughs> and I went, yeah, and I went, hello. I said, oh, I'm going to breathe in. Good job, Mama size six. Um, I said, Lee, is that um, one of them things you ride? I went, yeah, yeah, yeah. I went over and said hello, introduced myself, and he was, uh, that's the first time I met him. Very nice Gen chap, gentleman. And uh, we have been on many, uh, many uh, cruise together. Anyway, this is, I did say clever, cleverly coppice or something. This is cluely coppice, and it's nice down here. It goes from this sort of track now to a nice bit of uh, off road. This is the sort of stuff I like, um, I do like riding. <laughs> I like to ride. Jump your Land Rover. I'm going to go around the um, nice park in a bit. But, um, yeah, let's put some uh, music on. with the M54 just there and level with Jaguar Land Rover nice little um, track this is to do you can't go up that way but you can go down here and we'll do a left if you do a right that takes you over the motorway and um, towards Featherstone and Shearsville, that sort of way. But we're going to go up here, which is a perfectly legal bridle way. Now at the top here, I was here about a month ago, and the rain, it did rain quite badly. See all the blossom on the tree. Um, it's ran quite badly and I didn't fancy going round the, the um, park a bit and I found a little way through so I might go and try that now and drop down back and through so we shall see so here you come up to the end of this path and you normally go right down and around which I've done a thousand times yeah, oh they took it away you could get through here and you could go up that little track there and uh, it brought you out at the other end of the like, woodland walk but obviously they've cottoned on to people trying to go through unless there's another way can't see anything hmm. this should be clear anyway to be honest so let's go and have a look still got all the daffs out be the bluebells soon They're going to build something here, you can tell, can't you? All that um, machinery. Random car park in the middle of nowhere. But, uh, nice little track this is. Quite um, out of the wind as well. Let's try and get me uh, extended pole at the right angle. Sorry, very professional. Let's try and go, uh, see how fast we can go. Get the beeps on. doing about 25 
downhill as well. Don't see tying. Oh, it's very loose. <laughs> Through the mud. Right. Let's go this way. See you at the back. See you back at the top. So we were just over there and we've gone all the way around and I've just found a nice little bench to sit on. Those are the woods we're going to be going into. And I was just doing a quick check on the King Song S18. Uh, max speed was 34.8 kilometres an hour, which I'll let you go and Google that. I've got 68% battery life left, remaining is 75 kilometres. Obviously, this is standing still. Uh, there you go. Temperature sitting at 18 degrees. Um, near the horn, ready? <laughs> That's so terrible. At least on the XL, it used to go. Ah, excuse me. Hi, hi, hi. Nice. Such a nice day. Um, so, yeah, still got loads of, uh, you know, battery life in it. Used, uh, not a problem, really. So, these are the woods we're going to be going into. This is the other end where I was over there. I said you could get through and go up the main road. So, without further ado, let's go and have a look. I've ridden two here on my bike. It is a nice bit of um, track. Just reminds me of Baggeridge. But those, um, those vehicles look like they might be digging, excavating for... Um, I'm sure this was going to be a country park. Not too sure. It's only a little short run through here. Um, and this is the other end of that track where you could get through. But they've obviously um, put a stop to it until it's all open. So, let's head that way. Which is towards Codsall. Now I think it'd be rude not to ride through there because at this time of year it should be quite clear. So I'm going to have to go just down to this bit, turn off and then come back up on the uh, the other side. So I'll be back in a short while and we'll go through them set of woods. Ivan, you'd be proud of me. I just, oh shit, oh, I hopped up a curve. So this is, I've ridden through here on my bike before. How muddy is it? Uh, oh, the sign's gone for us. Oh. <laughs> right, note to self, you can't get your pedals through there when they're down. <laughs> oh well, when in Rome, let's just check uh, check any damage. I'm all right, Jack. Well, they do fit, but only just, probably with an inch either side. Oh well, these things aren't designed to sit on the shelf, are they? So the trail is looking not too bad. Give it a couple of months, and this will all just be overgrown. But, uh, like I say, these are UCs. I don't buy them to sit in the garage. Oh god, it is a bit muddy. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. It's a bit muddier than what I'd um, thought. Have a look. It's a bit of a mixture, really. It's like a bit of hardcore, but it looks like melting bloody plastic. Runs alongside this stream, unless it's the underlay that sits under, you know, they put that stuff down like a membrane to um, stop the weeds growing through. But this, this is completely impassable and impossible in the summer. There's just that many brambles and nettles and ferns all up here. It's nice though at this time of year, springtime, just cruise through. It's never a proper ride unless you fall off, is it? Well, <laughs> that's to be, um, let's put you on extending. Eh? Come on, there's another one in there. There we go. <laughs> oh, okay, right. Extendy, wobble, feet in position, all good. And we go to the left here. Oh, I don't want to pedal. Stry, oh God, I'm this. this mud, well, the, the ground is like super tacky. Trials are so nice though. Look at that. That's sweet canary and potatoes, that is. Oh, smells like dodgy cooking. It smells like 
pet food. <laughs> nice though. I've got to try and concentrate on my vlog. And where I'm going, this is um, right in Ivan's backyard. This is Penderford Way. This will bring me back out onto the canal. Crack! Oh, I thought I was going to break that twig then. Yeah, this is nice. I can ride this way easily, but when I try and work it backwards, I can never find this trail because there's loads of little lot of other ones flying your helmet that go off there and I always turn off too soon. I come too soon. Right, I'm going right here. My um, EUC needs a clean anyway. So yeah, this is the this is how dry it is at the moment. It's absolutely fantastic. Yeah, there's like that one a little track there that I sometimes turn down. And um it's too soon. And you build your love on waste land through the barricades. Yeah, canal that way. This will take us up to the main road now. King Song! Ahoy! So that goes to the canal. And this will take us up onto the road that I crossed about 20 minutes ago. So I sort of just come from that direction, but it was over there. Um, and we're heading back this way. Um, so I've just basically gone all the way around and back to here. So this is a nice bit of park down here. Ivan, you've got some good um, stuff on your doorstep. They've only recently done all the um, park paths because um, they just used to be a bit of mud walked in by uh, the locals. Right, back in a bit, got um, human traffic. As you can see, brand new, brand new tracks. Canal. So we're going to uh, thank you. Tackle the bridge. Oh, we've got to tarmac now. Oh yes. Ooh. I thought. Well, that's obviously not where I could smell, but I could smell a barbecue just a bit more. A few more people. Right, I'll come back in a bit. So that canal we've just come down, I think takes you towards, I should say on here. Well, this is the cycle track to Billbrook and Codsell. That's the way I just went, and that's the way I'm going. But that canal, this T-junction here, takes you up towards um, Brood. Let's go, get the power up this hill. The old finger post. <laughs> and descend, nice and gentle. Heading back now. Probably done about, hopefully do about 15 miles today. Uh, there's a couple of ways I can head back, but at the moment we're heading this way. This bit I hate, especially when it's been raining heavy, because Tre sewage treatment plant is over there, but you just have to take it easy through all of these because I haven't got a clue what I'm riding through. But as long as you just take it easy, you don't get much, like being on the loo, you don't get much splashback. I've just noticed my battery's gone quite low, so I'm either going to go past the T junction where I came on by Aldersley, you can do a right and go up through Whitmarines that way or I'll go along with the canal. I'll let you know in a bit. Right, decided to go for plan B. <coughs> Cheers. Thank you. So it was canal to Whitmarines and I was gonna go railway walk which is just oh, oh hang on, hold tight. Which is just over there but I decided not to So there, yeah, Plan B, Ben Drew. 
always have a plan B. All clear behind. So we're going to go crowd the street and then past the water training ground, Bantop Park, and then. Come oh, on. We will finish today's vlog on the bench of Richard Dick Rhodes. In loving memory. Thank you, Dick. So, uh, there we go. Today's vlog. I will. I have been running relive today, so I'll put that in at the end, so you can see the distance, elevation, etc., etc. It's a nice bit of graffiti behind me, isn't it? Uh, right. Back in a moment. Just had the jogger go past me. Jog on! Right, try and silhouette the sun out. Um, yeah, today's vlog, um, just wanted to give you my opinion on the 400 mile um, distance of the King Song S18. I do like it. It's a keeper. I'd love this one in Spain. Uh, and on that terrible disappointment, as they used to say on Top Gear, um, give us a thumbs up. But, you know, and go and click the the ding dong um, subscribers thank you for sticking with me on my journey and hello to all new subscribers as per normal um, yeah just that's it for today um, relive I'll put in right now and get my finger out the way of the camera as I always say past the pronto ciao last little bit of recording in the park Bantark Pronto, ciao! Mm.